Ian Freeman and I'm running for school board. I'm wearing a silly hat because there's a solidarity day uh, to show solidarity for some kids that have been picked on by an administrator uh, wearing rainbow colors. So a couple of us, a few of us here have some rainbows, uh, rainbow colors on today. But I'll also be handing out information for parents, uh, you know, to consider me as a candidate for school board in the upcoming election. How are you doing? Great. How are you today? Good. Um, I know the rules, right? I'm gonna ask one time, and then you're going, you're gonna get arrested. Okay. The sidewalk is the barrier. Go over to the sidewalk, off the edge. I, I, I appreciate that. That's why if you stand on the grass over there and turn your sign in, that would be the appropriate thing to do. But you have gotta get off the grass and over on the sidewalk over there. Yep. Sure, sure. Absolutely. Thank you, Graham. KPD came and rolled up and informed us that we would be arrested if we stood three feet that way. Were we on your own volition today? Yeah, you stand out. <laughs> the issue is that the school district, they are not going to allow him to hand out vote for Ian things. Do you have any thoughts about the First Amendment and how this applies? I do. It's just not appropriate. Do you see the infringement happening here today? Do you see that you're enforcing an infringement on free speech? Not at all. It's a limited access building. You said he would be arrested if he stood on that part of the grass, but this part of the grass is okay. Um, so is that a free speech zone? No, it's a, uh, it's a property boundary zone. So is this public property? It's public property. No, Who owns that? Well, I'm going to guess that he school district owns that and the school district owning the property even though we could call it public property has all the right in the world to limit whatever goes on on their property and we're just here visiting i mean i don't think you i, I certainly don't feel that you pose any threat so it's always nice to visit with you guys you would expect someone who's forced to pay for some place to expect to be allowed there and i like how they get to park where it please in the fire zone and stand where they want but apparently a few kids had gotten in trouble for wearing rainbow colors to school and an administrator claimed that they were uncomfortable for the school environment so basically i set up my own little peaceful protest and decided that i was going to get everyone to wear a rainbow Do you feel like you have to be here? You know we're not a threat, but you're still here, so I'm just wondering. I'll tell you, it's an interesting thing. I don't perceive you as much of a threat in terms of causing violence or being violent. I've never seen that. Right. I mean, even when you, I'm hesitant to say ran away. Your little Scotty evil run down the street the other day. I'm just picking. Everyone's afraid of everything. I give you guys credit. I've seen you dance around Manadnock a couple times. And, yeah. Uh, is there something better we could be doing? Well, sure. Hard for me to say. Fair amount, probably think we ought to be out clicking the radar on and off. So oh, no, I don't want you doing that. No, you don't. <laughs> no one wants that. I, we'll stand here and make sure that you guys are all set. Okay. Doesn't matter. You to hand stuff out. That's what I'll, that's the whole thing. So if you just do that, that would be good. Thank Wait, are you, are you threatening this little girl? Not at all, Gary. Come what on are you now. doing? Wait, what did you have to go talk to her about? She has to move off the property. To but she's a student. Out. Doesn't matter. She needs permission to hand stuff out. So since it's after school, then she's not like not considered a student. She's well, just a member of the public. That, well, it's I well, that's hard to say. They think they own them until they get home. Sometimes there was a problem with her being on on that part that's of the correct. ground. Yep. Were there any administrators who had a problem with all the rainbow today? Nope. In fact, Burke took it quite nicely. In fact, he said, oh, oh boy, I forgot to wear my rainbow tie. Well, how did you feel about that? Made my day. 